freaky and freaked us out. Uh, you freaked Jennifer out. Freaked out. First oh yeah, I've forgotten about that. I've forgotten about that. It was uh, about her first day at school. I first think, day at school, yeah. Yeah, it was weird. And you were able to guess what she was thinking about. And then later tweeted um, about my lady garden. Yes, was I right? You were kind of right. Kind of right, yes. <laughs> Just to anyway, it's not fully gone. Because she got laser pretty she, she could get lasers. Stop talking about it. <laughs> now, I have to say, Keith, the last time you were in, I was asking about weight loss and stuff like that. And he put um, predictions in an envelope, right? Or, or, yeah. or Dermot put it in an envelope. We didn't open it. No, none of us opened it. We haven't seen it since. We haven't seen it since. I am freaked out the last two or three days, right? Because mm. I'm just absolutely freaked out by it, what's in it, because I'm just constantly thinking about you in a mental way. <laughs> <laughs> so can I open it now? Well, hang on, no, no, because there's a very specific way we're going to do this, because okay. this deals with not just the past and not the present, but also the future. Right. So we've got a scissors here, because I want to make sure I don't rip any contents. And I want to make sure it hasn't been tempered with it. Now, you said you haven't seen it, but it's important. I haven't seen it either. It's been in your possession here. It's been locked away. Dermot, Dermot said it's been locked away. So we're going to cut across the top here, because there is something inside. And you're going to perform a couple of actions now in a moment. Actually, while I'm doing this, uh, Jen, you might have a look at that. It's just a dictionary. And uh, Bernard, you have a look at these. These are ESP cards. They're designed for paranormal... Uh, I suppose tests, if you like. So if you've just yeah. tuned in for the first time, a couple of weeks ago, Keith Barry called in, he put something in an envelope, he sealed the envelope, and I, we believe they're predictions or something. He's just yeah, they're the estimations again. is what I like to call them. In other words, and, uh, and this says, Keith Barry, uh, 19th to the 3rd, 2014, your signatures are all over everything, so nothing to be tempered with. Everybody happy that everything's fair? Oh, and I'm board? freaked out! Okay, so here's what's going to happen. We've got a dictionary here. Dictionaries contain thousands and thousands of words. So, Jen, you're going to select a word at random, okay? If you were to just browse through, you'd probably pick one that would suit your personality. So, and what kind of word do you think she would have picked? I think Sassy. Like... Sassy, see? Okay, <laughs> so I... How old are you? I, uh, and by the way, okay, Who? so let me preset this up first of all. This was dropped in on the 19th of March. Uh, you've had it in your possession. But more importantly than that, you're going to make some decisions now that would affect the outcome of what's inside that envelope. Both of you are going to make decisions right now. So, first of all, Jen... Uh, and this is important for people at home listening. I'm going to flick through the dictionary. Anytime you want, you just say stop. Stop. Okay, I'm looking away. I look at the first word at the top of the page, like the kind of index word, okay? Have you yeah, got it? Got okay, it. I'll show it to the camera as well. And we'll leave the dictionary open face down so I can't see it, okay? So you've got those, uh, what they're called, Paralabs cards. You can check these out online. But basically, it's for testing people for paranormal ability. And they're just picture art cards. So we've got an umbrella there. We've got a lighthouse. Bernard, you call them out so people realise I'm not miscalling. What are uh, they? Uh, that's a car, a teapot, a book, um, a letter, cheese, uh, cherries, um, a kettle, a filter, a turtle, flour. The point is that they're yeah, all different. There's about 50 yeah, of these right. here, yeah? Okay. So, and you mixed them up there a second ago. We'll give them an extra mix up. And the idea is this. Uh, it doesn't even matter, but you're going to just cut them anywhere you want. So scoot around here real quick. Scoot around here real quick. Ah! <laughs> okay, cut them anywhere you want. Go ahead and cut them. All right, so I want you to complete the cut. So in other words, mark exactly where you cut there. Okay, so you're happy that you cut those at random, yes? And do you know which picture card you've cut to? Bernard, you're on the radio. You, no, you have to no, see it, not you have to no, no, I don't. I no. Don't know. Yeah, okay, yeah. I don't want you to know just yet. So I want you to just go ahead and slide that and put your hand face down on it. Put your hand okay. face down on that. So Bernard he selected his hand down the top of the card that he selected. So he selected one at random. Yes, and you've got your hand on it. You don't know what it is. You've got a word in your mind right now. This envelope has been in your possession since before the experiment even began. I'm going to kind of just cut it's it open at the, the very top. Fingertip stuff. Everybody's happy. Everything's fair and above board right now. Yes. Don't put that scissors near him. He's not allowed to play with. He's food. not burned. Leave the scissors. Okay, there it is, right there. It's been in your possession since before the experiment even began. It's been here since uh, the 19th of March. Yes. Okay, uh, I want you to take it. It's a piece of paper. Hand it to Jennifer. Jennifer has the piece of paper. From inside the envelope. Inside the envelope. Open it up, Jen. Open it up. Okay. Will I open it? Envelopes can you open inside it up? envelopes. Yeah. In your possession, this is about the past, the present, and the future. So you can start. I start reading out from the very bottom of the left hand side. The very bottom of the left hand side. Down here? No, no, of the piece of paper. Yeah. Yeah, so, so down here. That first. Um, Jen will think of snow. Ah! Are, you <laughs> thinking, are you thinking of snow? 
Yeah. So freaky. Okay. Yeah. yeah Snow. Yeah, yeah. And Snow. Bernard will choose cheese. Now, Bernard, look, I want everybody to realize if he cut one above, it would have been a pear or cherries. One below, it would have been like a guitar. Have a look. And you don't even know what one is underneath your hand. Jeez. 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 And you did that in the present, but this has to deal with the past and the future as well. Some things have happened since the 19th of March, and these have been in your possession. I want you to just go ahead and read out loud from the top, wherever you want. There's tons of stuff on there. I'll scribble these down. A giant and... rat found in attic. Mm-hmm. We so read that, that story ourselves. Yeah. yeah, that's definitely happened. The rat sounded like he was eating the crunch. He was so loud. And just to remind people, this has been in your possession since 19th yes. of March. Uh, Aircom will collect from 35,000 after Bill mess up. On the news this morning. On the news yeah, this morning, says our official German news head. Uh, Bernard will be down around £2. So do you know what, uh, how, are you down any weight? You are, you said. I'm, da I'm, down, I'm down nearly £4, yeah. Okay, so it was a little bit out there. But Even better. Uh, sports, G in brackets, GA star and sex scandal. Wow. Oh, that wow. happened, yeah. Uh, Letterman to retire. Wow. Munster beat to lose by three to five. So this is... Well, that's this coming Saturday. This, is this I think, weekend. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, so, so you're saying Munster will beat to lose yep. five three. Okay. Good so we'll check hour. back that in with Mon on Monday. Security breach in RT in May. That's the future. Yep. That's coming up. Oh. Uh, Nigella <laughs> refused... For you guys. Nigella refused entry in the USA. That's, that's happened. That's already happened, right? Happened. Uh, top Fine Gael politician in sex scandal. That's going to happen. Oh, yeah, that hasn't happened yet. That's coming. <laughs> <laughs> I'm afraid to read That's that okay. out. We're doing the past, the present, it's and the going, future. going, going to happen. Going to happen. Oh, yeah. it definitely is. I don't. I know who it is too, but I can't say. So, so month. So wow. I don't. What? I don't know what to say. But You're I, how did you? How was? <laughs> uh, uh, uh. How did you do it? Well, just come to the Olympia any night for the next 11 <laughs> nights. I just happen to be there for a run with Brain Hacker. I'm on tour as well. And uh, all the details are up on keithbarry.com. And we're having an amazing time. Two great reviews, by the way, in the Independent and the Herald today of the show. So for I'm your, very grateful for that as well. For your show? Yeah, yeah. Well, They've done. never given me a good review ever before. No way. So I've had two of them. But you know what day. I've noticed, actually, is uh, on Twitter, loads of people kind of happily freaked out by it going oh my god it was amazing you know well, on leaving the show yeah no, it's just a, it's a good old laugh I mean it's a comedy based mentalism show but more importantly I have a sceptic chair on stage because I know there's a new wave of sceptics there so I get about I don't know it's 50 or 100 sceptics and I, and I get them up in the chair and then I just beat them down into submission on that's stage. a great idea we should do that next week on the show <laughs> when, when uh, are the three of you coming into the Olympia I'll get one of you on stage oh we're coming, oh, we're coming. Yeah, you, yeah, you yeah, should definitely. know when we're coming should you <laughs> 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 Thanks very much, Keith Barry. Yay! We'll Thanks. check back in on Monday about that Toulouse Monster prediction as well. Yeah, yeah, good. I hope you're right. Yeah. I'm going to Paddy Power straight away. <laughs> Here's Hard Five. This is 2FM. We're living for the weekend.